think I'll probably just choose my hair. Uh, so let's go back. And I like the pacing of this game because it's easier to get into than the first one. Um, but it, it's first one's the best in my opinion. I don't hate the third one either. This one is just more linear. So it's like if I want to just sit down and enjoy a Dragon Age game and not have to do a bunch of stuff, I can just jump into DA2 and just go with it. You know, whereas Inquisition, you have to do a lot of stuff. Love grinding. And I think my mods are mostly working. So I'm sorry if some of the textures are bugged out or messed up. My character creation stuff's fine. I just tested it like last night. So hopefully there's no problems there. And I heard Dreadwolf is coming out next year, maybe. If it even comes out. Watch it get cancelled like within three months of releasing. I remember when this came out, it was a huge deal. Like I got it day one. I've had gentler invitations. <laughs> I am Cassandra Pentagust, seeker of the Chantry. <laughs> and just, uh, what are you seeking? The champion. Uh, which one? You know exactly why I'm here. <laughs> Time to start talking, dwarf. They tell me you're good at it. <laughs> what do you want to know? That was quite a thrust. I read through the book. So if you haven't played Origins, they just, um, they don't really tell you what's going on, I guess, you know. Just sort of assume that you know what's, what's what. What's your favorite? I would say Origins just because that's what I um sooner or later. Then we make our stand here. Started with. Prepare yourself. Inquisition wasn't as bad as people said it was. It did get game of the year, didn't it? Oh, I, for I forgot. It's a uh, move or auto attack. I totally forgot. This up forever. We'll make it through this together. Here they come. I forgot about I also forgot about the blood in the face. My blade. All right, uh, I have to click it. Oh, yours, brother. Hell <laughs> is was left was his boots. I don't know. This should be fun. I'm gonna turn my brain off, kind of RPG. But also a cry. You know what I'm talking about. If you play this, you know what I'm talking about. Watch, I'm going to stomp this big boy. Rip. There's no end to them. Oh no, it's a Dargan. Dargan with a helmet. That's not what really happened. <laughs> Bullshit. Does that not match the story you've heard, Seeker? I'm not interested in stories. 
I came to hear the truth. <laughs> what makes you think I know the truth? Don't lie to me! You knew her even before she became the champion. Even if I did, I don't know where she is now. Do you have any idea what's at stake here? Let me guess. Your precious chantries fall into pieces and put the entire world on the brink of war. And you need the one person... Yeah, Inquisition was... I liked it. It was a little too grindy at times, but... Actually, the more I played it, the more I put time in, the more I actually did enjoy it. But Origins is still, yeah, it's my favorite. Not at all. <coughs> I heard they're remaking it. But if they do that, I hope they don't change the combat. Just update it. Like, keep it the way it was. Sort of like... I don't know how you say it. It's like halfway between D&D &D and action combat. Okay, so all I'm going to do... Oh, I can't change the hair. Okay, there we go. Like I want, the, I want like the default face, but I don't know. I got like a million hairstyles with my uh, charging revamp. I guess is that what you call it? Oh, those are all the vanilla ones, aren't they? So I can't actually use my keyboard to do this. It's like, I just cycle through like a million of them. It's so funny. I don't know. That's fine. Um, yeah, I can't change all that. And why are her um, like eyes so far apart? Can't change that. So. What I usually do is the Martyr, that's what I always play as the Dalish Mage. In, um... Origins. Like, that's what I always do. Actually, I think I only played a human, like, once, maybe? I don't know how that's... I don't know if that's how you play, but... I always choose the Martyr. It's kind of sad, too, you know? It's just like your character coming to an end. I don't think they're ever gonna bring the cha or the hero for all them back. Oh, sorry, I didn't answer you earlier. Um, it's like a homemade ravioli with chicken and mushrooms, sort of a pasta mix. The battle was a disaster. King Kalen died on the field with his men, betrayed by his most trusted general. Yeah, at first I thought it was like, um, like <laughs> Chef Oyardi ravioli, <laughs> but no, it's like actual, uh, like home cooked ravioli. Barely escaped in time. So you may not have noticed this, but my last few streams, my audio was set to one side only, like surround on my microphone. So I did seven. Dogma 2 videos like that and I didn't realize it because I just edit them and I didn't actually hear like the audio sounded fine but I didn't realize that you could only hear my voice on one side like one speaker or one headphone For the moment, make us save us. oh wait I'm a mage that means Bethany is um yeah I won't say anymore I also really like this mod that gets rid of the dial and puts it like this, like in Origins. I love it. Is that, you know, you can actually see what she's going to say instead of the expression wheel. I know how much Lothering meant to you, but we have to move. Yes, you're right. We should have run sooner. Why did we wait so long? Well, why are you looking at me? I've been running since Ostagar. Listen, you two. The Darkspawn could be on us any minute. Why are they afraid of fire? That's what I always wondered of this part. Then let's go. Lead on. Doggo! Right, DLC. I don't know. I think she looks okay. 
All right. Yeah, I think like the UI is the only thing I don't like about this game. Like, oh, they should have just kept it for the original. Three though, I liked. Oh yeah, and they'll give you fireball. Right away, they give you mind blast though. However, crushing prison is really good in the original, and they got kind of nerfed in this. You'll see, you'll see what I mean one day. I'll play Origins. It's ridiculous. Mages were so overpowered in that game. Like you could literally have a team of just mages. You could have like an arcane warrior, you know, and then one spirit healer and two blood mages or are... yeah. Where are we going? Away from the dark spawn. Where else? And then where? We can't just wander aimlessly. We stay alive. That's the only thing we need to worry about right now. We can go to Kirkwall. Kirkwall? Are you sure that's wise? There's a lot of Templars in Kirkwall, Mother. I know that. But we still have... Yeah, it's ridiculous. <laughs> like how overpowered they were. Uh, then and you could have like three bars of spells. Like it was unreal. I'll just be happy Crushing then. prison, walking bomb. And then the blood mage abilities. Um, so many passives too. So he bugged out the last time I played this, so I think he's going to bug out when he did after this. He was like, had all blue armor, like missing textures. So Aveline's the only tank, it right? Because I usually run with Aveline, Varric, myself, and um, Anders. But I know... Well, and Bethany. Until Anders. But I know when you go to the deep roads. Um, You want to take Carver. So I might be short one mage. So I might actually put one point in a healing spell. Just to cover. Worse. Apostate, keep your distance. Well, the Maker has a sense of humor. <laughs> Darkspawn and now a Templar. I thought they all abandoned Lothering. The spawn are clear in their intent, but a mage is always unknown. The order dictates. Wesley. The order dictates. What I dictate my spear up your butt. The maker understands. <laughs> Staff, not spear. Of course. I am Aveline Valen. This is my husband, Sir Wesley. Yeah, she's a good tank. I don't like Cassandra that much in three. I use that that gray ward the, the gray warden guy. I'm watching. Because Cassandra's actually not a like a tank build. Like she's a, just a Templar. For now, we move with you. North is cut off. We barely escaped the main body of the Horde. Then we're trapped. The wilds are to the south. That's no way out. We have no choice. The Darkspawn have us fenced in. We go south. Oh, and um, I'll be finishing uh, RE6 on Monday, so... I might do one on Wednesday. I don't know yet. I don't want to overdo myself, but... <laughs> Carver rivalry. Carver hates me no matter what I do. Like, I don't know. I can never make him happy, ever. Ah, he looks fine for now. And there's supposed to be like 4k or higher textures right now. I don't know. I can't really feel it. That's my dog. Oh, there he is. Oh, can I quickly do this? Oh, I can. Uh, give me the power of fire. So I can destroy everybody. There's no point in even doing hers. For reasons I cannot, cannot say. Um, I'm going to give him... What can he get? Here. Here. 
Oh no! The horde is coming. <laughs> Laura Bailey. I was playing Dragon's Dogma 1 today and I heard her voice in one of my pawns. So I haven't heard her in DD2 at all. I don't know if she's in it, but I know the lady who plays the Inquisitor in 3 is. She's like my main pawn, which actually she, I lent her out to a bunch of people and she got like two ratings. I guess people liked her, like, like eight or nine people have used her already. She's also in her underwear, so maybe that's why. Not on purpose. She's like, she's a ranger, so she's wearing this armor that's, uh, she's sort of not wearing pants. Okay. Yeah, it's the controls are so different from each game. Like it's they just keep making you relearn everything over and over. I can do this. You'll see. I was gonna get like um ice for this character, but I just wanna do fire. I don't know. Uh oh. Yeah, it's really funny. She's got a bunch of thumbs up, I guess. Little Casey doing her job. It's a nice break from DD2. I've been playing it like non stop for like the last two days. We must press towards the wild. I was playing it the one night till like four or five in the morning. Now, I know there's a codex over here. Yeah. Tell me your secrets, dead refugee. Uh, I don't have a rogue. Not going to happen. Oh, I didn't see what he had. Well, I need that because of the blood magic. Or no, not cunning. If you're going to be a blood mage, like you have to have some extra health, unfortunately. Uh, what do I want? See, like this used to be way more powerful, but it kind of sucks now. And I haven't played this game in a long time. The spell, spirit bolt, sucks, sucks. This, yeah. Oh, wait. Gotta relearn the game. It's been like a, a long time since I played. I don't know, like two years? Three years? Uh oh, here comes the big boy. Strength. Oh man, they just pissed him off. Ooh. I don't think she'll be able to walk that one off. So do you play something console mostly then? So like you can't have mods? Get out of here. Yeah. I don't know if I would have played unmodded. It would probably be like night and day. Well, not night and day different, but I'm sorry, mistress. Your daughter. It's not that kind of game where uh, 
it's like Skyrim, you know, it's like completely different from the original. Just like add some nice touches and character creation and stuff. Her life to save us. I don't want a hero. I want my daughter. How could you let her charge off like that? Oh, my poor little girl. My sweetheart. If we stand here weeping, the Darkspawn will take the rest of us too. Allow me to commend your daughter's soul to the Maker, Mistress. Ashes we were, and ashes we become. Maker, give this young woman a place at your side. Let us take comfort. I want her armor if they're going to leave her here. In eternity. I will never. And you can get like a budget laptop. That's like decent settings for like seven, eight hundred bucks, but that's still seven, eight hundred dollars. Our lives are more valuable to her than our prayers. Let's go. Ooh. Flames, we're too late. Retreat. No. Hey, this gets not crazy. But my favorite area in Dragon Age is like the deep roads. I know. I'm like a cave gremlin or something. All oh, yours broke? Yeah, mine broke too. I just got a new one. So I could have a, like uh, modding origins on it. Just to play when I'm not at home. Yeah, I don't envy you, that's for sure. I don't know what I would do. I'd be pretty miserable. I lost my computer last year for like three months. No, two years ago for two, three months. Well, it died. What have we here? Used to be we never got visitors to the wilds, but now it seems they arrive in hordes. Impressive. Where'd you learn how to turn into a dragon? Perhaps I am a dragon. If so, count yourself lucky. The smell of burning darkspawn does nothing for the appetite. If you wish to flee the darkspawn, you should know you are heading in the wrong direction. So you're just going to leave us here? And why not? I spotted the most curious sight. A mighty ogre vanquished. Who could perform such a feat? But now my curiosity is sated and you are safe for the moment. Is that not enough? We can get to Kirkwall on our own. Kirkwall? My, but that is quite the voyage you plan. So far. Simply to flee the darkspawn. Our home is gone. But I don't imagine you care. I see. Hurtled into the chaos, you fight. And the world will shake before you. Is it fate or chance? I can never decide. It appears fortune smiles on us both today. I may be able to help you yet. There must be a catch. <laughs> I kind of, I kind of miss her um swamp look in Origins. You know where she's just wearing like a dirty old robe. Should we even trust her? We don't even know what she is. I know what she is. The Witch of the Wilds. Some call me that. Also Flemeth, Asha Bellinar, an old hag who talks too much. <laughs> Does it matter? I offer you this. I will get your group past the Horde in exchange for a simple delivery to a place not far out of your way. 
Would you do this for a witch of the wilds? We don't have much choice. We never do. There is a you know, it seems like a lot of talking, but it's actually interesting dialogue. Aside from Starfield dialogue. I only say that because I decided to try it out again like the other day and figured I might not be as bored when I play it. I don't know. It's still, it's still a sleep aid for me. Ooh, he's got the Rona. No, leave him alone. What has been done to your man is within his blood already. You lie. She's right, Aveline. I can feel the corruption inside me. Give him a booster. There must be something we can do. The only cure I know of is to become a grave warden. They all died at Ostagar. Not all, but the last are now beyond your reach. Aveline, listen to me. You can't ask me this. I won't. Please. The corruption is a slow death. I can't. Gonna hate me for this later, probably. Thank you. an end there can be no peace well that's one more templar down it gets however i made it many to go your struggles have only yeah i was pretty tired last night too to be honest with you i was running out of steam near the end there trying to finish up Ada's thing i kept dying you expect me to believe a myth swooped out of the wild to save the champion oh come now seeker do i need to recite the tale of the warden as well no. Perhaps I shouldn't be surprised to hear of her involvement. I liked my version better, too. What else aren't you telling me, then? Did she send someone with the champion? In a matter of speaking. Yeah, and I think on Monday and Tuesday, I'm probably going to be but if you tell me a little earlier. To Kirkwall on a dragon. Nothing so fanciful, I assure you. The witch kept her word. And got them to Guaran, where they took ship. They sailed north across the waking sea, lashed by terrible storms. And I think the only weakness that Bioware has is it takes a while for things to get going, but once you get past that point, like it's the game really picks up. It's just getting over that initial intro hurdle. Kirkwall, the city of chains. Long ago, it was part of the Imperium. Slaves coming from far and wide to work the quarries. Now, it's a free city. But I use the word loosely. Sail through those black cliffs and you'll see what the slaves of old saw. The gallows, welcoming you. That's where their ship landed. With all the so I heard that um, Dreadwolf... He's getting rid of the party system. I'm I'm gonna guess that's a rumor, but that I don't know why, why even bother, right? Like the whole reason people play Dragon Age is to have the parties and companions and you know the social aspect. Oh god, is it crashing? Okay, good. I thought it was gonna crash for a sec.
Yeah, I don't know. Just why, why even like, just, I don't know. Like, yeah, you have to grow with the times and stuff like that, but don't get rid of like why people play your game. Like I play them for the, you know, social part, storyline, party system, RPG stuff. Like if it's just you, then you're not, you're just playing an action RPG. Which I, I mean, I would still play it, but it doesn't really make a lot of sense. <laughs> Someone's missing their head. I knew there would be something wrong. They're not letting anyone into the city. What? <laughs> the headless horseman guy is walking around. Look at them all. I wonder how many more headless freaks I'll run into. Yeah, like don't touch it. Like even go backwards towards origin a little bit. Because Baldur's Gate 3 did so well. I'm actually I'm thinking a lot of studios are gonna backpedal to the old system, like old games so long as play style because of how well BG3 did. We need to find Gamlin. Our family has always been highly regarded in Kirkwall. He can do something, I'm sure of it. Not completely back to BG3 because I don't like turn based. The guards seem to be reporting to that. But just a little bit more, you know, classic. That'd be nice. Look at his headless people. Oh no. Whatever. Get back to the crowd, you lot. Trying to bully your way through won't get you into Kirkwall any faster. But you do intend to let us in. <laughs> we have enough poor of our own in the free marches. We don't need you refugees piling up here like a midden's heap. There must be someone in charge I can speak with. <sighs> yes, yes. Always the same story. You want in, talk to Captain Yuald. I'm just here to keep you refuse from climbing the walls. Oh, Aveline did not like that. Well, no. Let me guess, I, I wasn't able to loot Bethany. No. Stamina. Sure. Do you have Tell me, how did your family escape loathering? Almost everyone. Oh, I hope there's no more. I think it's just the random citizens that are headless. She wasn't with us. What yeah, it looks like it. Let us through, you flaming blighter. We're not staying in this pit. Then get back on your ship and leave. Kirkwall has no more room for refugees. The ship's already gone. We've paid good coin to get here. You and half of Ferelden. There's nothing I can do. The city is full. You wouldn't be out here if nobody could enter. That's right. We've seen you let lots of people through. Citizens and merchants that make it worth our while. I'll assume that you don't have any more coin than these gentlemen. We've been letting you Ferelden's in for months. You're too late. There's no more room. But we've got family here. I've heard claims like that a thousand times already. Trust me. We'll find some ships to take you all back to Ferelden eventually. Until then, you stay here. Perhaps if we knew exactly what it would take to get in. No foreigner can enter unless they can prove they have coin to bring into the city. You mean a bribe? Technically, the Viscount's order that no one enters. You want to be a special case, you have to be special. It's outrageous. It took all our coin just to get here. You want eyes looking the other way? That takes convincing. And the price goes up each day this continues. Our uncle is Gamlin Amel. He knows we're coming. Surely someone could find him. Gamlin? I know that name. He's a nobleman here in the city. Our family has an estate. A nobleman? The only Gamlin I know is a weasel who couldn't rub two coppers together. He comes back, I'll bring you to him. But I don't have time to... What? You're gonna let them through? <laughs> what? I didn't say anything about... We've been here for four days. They just got here. That's it. We're carving our way out of here. Men! Are we going to kill all the guards in the, the keep? Oh yeah, sure, that'll work out well for you. Oh, wait. Doggo!
They appeared out of nowhere. Help. Unbelievable. <sighs> Captain, are you all right? I am, no thanks to you. Where is everyone? Go find them. I want this kept under control. You have my thanks. Look, I can't get you into the city. It's not my decision. But I'll find your uncle and bring him here. It's been three days. This waiting has to end. I'm sure it won't be much longer. Three days sitting on the... Wow. I wouldn't do that. I would have just left. Wait. I think someone's coming. Leandra. Damn girl. The years haven't been kind to you. Gamlin. Let me say up front, I wasn't expecting this. The Blight, your husband, dead. I uh, figured you'd pretty much be Ferelden for life. Oh, Gamlin, we came too late. My darling Bethany didn't make it. I'm dressed to guide her. Oh, make her save me. Leandra, don't drop this on me here. I don't even know if I can help you get in. I'm more concerned about Mother. Can you get her in at least? No. We stay together. I was hoping to grease some palms, but the Knight Commander's been cracking down. We're gonna need more grease. But what about the estate? Surely Father left something when he died? Right. Uh, about the estate. It's... um... gone. To settle a debt. I've been meaning to write you. Then there's no hope. N not quite. I know some people who might help. If you're not too delicate about the company you keep. What do you mean exactly, Gamlin? I talked to my contacts, and I found some people who might be willing to pay your way into the city. The catch is, you and your brother will have to work off the debt. For a year. A year? It's the best I could do. Trust me when I say a bunch of refugees won't get a better option anywhere else. Hmm. I'm sure we'll be free and clear before we know it. I managed to convince my contacts to come to the gallows to meet you personally. Miran heads up the mercenary company. I always uh, choose a Thenril. They're looking for recruits. A Thenril. I've done Miran like twice. A smuggler. Either one of them can help you. All you need to do is find them in the courtyard and convince them you're worth the trouble. Let's find them and see what they have to say. Oh, Gamlin, I don't know about this. It's a lot of coin, Leandra. Don't go expecting our name to carry the kind of weight it used to. And what of me? I will not allow others to incur debts on my behalf. I <laughs> can't see that it makes a difference. You look like a lady who can pull her own weight. Then you'll come with us. I have no real option. Thank you. Um, yeah, let's go see if Ethanerol's not bugged. Oh no, I can see her head. Are you a Ethanerol? You must be Gamlin's niece. Interesting. I don't know what he told you about us, but he certainly told us a great deal about you. Uh, how much exactly? Enough to pique our interest, provided you can justify your uncle's confidence. Tell me what you need done. There's a merchant named Cavro, friend of the Templars. So they let him set up his little shop here in the gallows. We supplied him in return for a piece of the take, but now he won't pay up. We can't go near him without him screaming for the guard, but you can. Get our money from him and your aunt. Hmm.
<laughs> hey there, what are you doing with that? Back away from it, friend. Now. Wait. This is a Fenril's doing, isn't it? You can tell that bitch I'm going straight to the guard again. Care to step in here? Only because this toad deserves it. You have a choice. Pay, or I beat it out of you and your men. Hey! Stay back. Just uh, take what's in the chest. <laughs> Talk about the worst card ever. Now I'm getting out of here. Let those guards find someone else to buy Dogland junk. Here you go. As requested. Will you look at that? Tell your uncle we'll make the arrangements. Welcome aboard. Alright, so... Any luck? Yes. They've agreed to help us. I'll speak to Athenril and see when the bribes can be made. Wait here. I guess we did it. We're here to stay, at least for a while. The blight may still spread, but for now we have a new home. If only Bethany were here with us. Oh, geez, stop it. <laughs> like. Let's just see what happens. We have a long year ahead of us. Thus began the champion's first year in Kirkwall. Word arrived from across the sea that the hero of Ferelden had defeated the Blight. Time to go home. But Lothering was destroyed. Kirkwall was the champion's home now. So she remained, paying off her debt. Made a name for herself in the underworld. It was a busy year in the city. That's when the Kunari landed. A great storm had caught their ship and left hundreds of warriors stranded in the city, waiting to return home. That's also when the trouble began with the mages. The Templars had become very powerful under Knight Commander Meredith. But most importantly, that's when I first met the champion. Oh yeah. That hit the spot. Okay. Oh, feeling energized now. Okay. That's good because the intro is over. I did. I ate while there. They were, um... In between the cutscenes. No. Adraste's tits, human. You know how many people want to hire onto this expedition? Look, we know you're going into the deep roads. You'll need to hire the best, and we're... No. You're too late. Already done. The money from this trip could fix everything. You need us. We fought Darkspawn. Look, precious, I don't care if you tore the horns off an ogre with your bare hands. You make him understand. We're running from your bloody Templars. Hey, now. Carver, do you want to get smacked? I know how you feel, but we'll earn no favors with your fist in his face. Then we do nothing, as always. <laughs> My brother can be hot-headed, but we do have the skills to benefit your expedition. You're looking for a quick way out of the slums, right? You and every other Ferelden in this dump. Find another meal ticket. Well, back to waiting for someone to turn us in. You can relax. After all, the Templars dogging us are mine. Did I sound that bad? Maker, I'm turning into Gamlin. Gamlin? He's got a head for this garbage. Maybe he can talk to Bartrand. He knows some people. After last week, we need all the coin and influence we can get. 
What happened last week? I wouldn't trust him with a silver. But dear uncle's at least as sleazy as Bartrand. How's that for a compliment? What else can we do? We're losing ground, and I don't fancy waking up in the gallows. Catch him. I knew a guy once who could take every coin out of your pockets just by smiling at you. But you, you don't have the style to work high down, let alone the merchant's guild. You might want to find yourself a new line of work. <laughs> Off you go. <gasps> How do you do? Merrick Tethras, at your service. I apologize for Bartrand. He wouldn't know an opportunity if it hit him square in the jaw. But you would. I would. What my brother doesn't realize is that we need someone like you. He would never admit it either. He's too proud. I, however, am quite practical. He said he didn't need another guard. We don't need another hireling. We need a partner. The truth is, Bartrand's been tearing his beard out trying to fund this on his own, but he can't do it. Invest in the expedition. Fifty sovereigns and he can't refuse. Not with me there to vouch for you. It sounds interesting. But if I had any gold, I wouldn't need this job. You need to think big. There's only a brief window after a blight when the deep roads won't be crawling with dark spawn. The treasure you find down there could set you and your family up for life. <laughs> Come on. Yeah. The dwarf makes some sense. No offense. Ravioli, chicken breast, and portobello mushrooms. It's a good idea. Certainly better than ending up in the gallows. We work together, you and I. And before you know it, you'll have all the capital you need. What do you say? You have a deal. Perfect. I love his voice. Uh, Brian Bloom, I think. You set aside some coin from every job and you'll have the money in no time. Sure, easy. But maybe Aveline's got some bounties out. She joined the city guard, right? We should talk privately when you get the chance. Alright, so we got a rogue, two warriors, now, and myself. So we gotta pick up uh, Aveline. High town, where the rich go to piss their money away. Equip smugglers. Oh, it's like the same thing. The best place in Kirkwall. All right. Um. So we gotta go to High Town to grab Aveline, and then I think we'll do some stuff. Does this guy have some armor? Nope. Olaf's armory. Archers. Uh, garbage. Who's this guy? You know, Junior, oh, it's the, uh, it's the rune dude. Ah, long time no see, my friend. Worthy. When did you get back into town? Oh, just a month or so ago. Things didn't work out in Orzammar. You aren't still working for Athenwell, are you? Your year must be up by now. Yes, I'm done with that. Good for you. Always nice to see someone striking out on their own. I'll tell you what. I still have my old contacts. You need some rune crafting done, I can arrange it for you. Take care, Hawk. Don't get dead. What? All right. Uh, actually, we have to go to Low Town because I have some DLC stuff. I think if my DLC things are working, they weren't working for Origins really. So let's go to Low Town. I think I've got like a bunch of armor and weapons I can grab. Funny, even with an SSD, I still have like fairly long load times. You know, Junior, you're looking at this all wrong. Whatever it is you're about to say, I'm not interested. I'm a professional younger brother. Trust me. The center of attention's the worst place to be. When things go wrong, and they always do. Here we go. That's where all the fingers point. Look at any kingdom in Fadus. You've 
got people who warm thrones. Oh, what a good boy. Hard to believe they left me nothing. Well, Mother was pretty steamed when you ran off with your Ferelden apostate. I'm still their daughter, their eldest. Yes, here we go. Uh, Malcolm's honor, fugitive's mantle. State's mask. I know a lot of this I can't wear. Leave that alone. I usually just take whatever I can. Come back for it later. It was this for Anders. And there was this one. Anders. Okay, um, I don't have a row. Oh, wait, I have a uh, Varric. Oh, wait, I forgot about Isabella. I totally forgot she was in this game. Man, I feel bad, right? I never used Sebastian, though. I don't know. Okay, so she needs this. That. Uh, Chevalier, Carver, I guess I can give it to him, the brat, Carver, Avalyn, main armor is like the important thing, handed weapon and shield, line overlay, Arlathon, or Isaac. The heck was that from? I don't remember. Man, look at all this crap. Yeah, I would say it's full. Uh, writing desk. Yes, the Black Emporium. Change my hair later. Uh, oh, there. My children have been in servitude. Yeah, so much stuff. For a year. They should be nobility. If wishes were poppy, we'd all be dreaming. Why was nothing set aside for us, Uncle? Your mother was supposed to marry the Comte de Lancey, and instead she ran off with some Ferelden apostate. You don't get to stay the favorite when you do that. Where is Father's will? If I could just see for myself. It's not here, all right? It was red. It went in the vault. No one needed to look at it again. Take me to the vault. Can't. It's in the cellar of the estate. Someone else lives there now. What daft bastard leaves that behind? It was old news. You think I've been sitting here for 25 years waiting for Leandra to slink back? Who bought the estate, Gavin? Perhaps Is it that orange cat? Was it the Reinhardts? No one you know. Get used Give her to some the catnip. Sister, that's where we're going to stay. <laughs> She'll just like feel all like, uh, what a mess. Get high and just roll around. To make things better for mother. Or do your cats like get more excited? Says, I'm having a hard time hating him. Playing caretaker for someone else's life. Stuck in their shadow. That's no way to live. Something you need to say. Look. If you want to join the fight over who lost the most, fine. But I never lived here. Mother even gave me her old key to try and stir something. But I didn't know Grandfather. Finding his will doesn't matter to me. You want a connection? This is where we'll find it. The once mighty Amels. A bunch of slavers are squatting on that dusty glory. What have you heard? Uncle's a chatty drunk. He was up to his neck and signed everything over. That's who has the estate. Apparently, the most extensive wine cellar in Kirkwall is now a slave highway from the Undercity. That's the family legacy. 
I think we need to pay them a visit. And look for Mother's missing paperwork. I'm sure they will be right neighborly about letting us poke around. We'll give them the chance, sure. All right, sister. If the key works, we'll clear the estate from the Undercity up. Yeah, my cat won't um, hang out with me if I don't have the space heater on. But I do feel like hitting someone. I'm with you, sister. For now. For now, yeah. That's such a Carver answer. All right, what do I want to wear? Well, actually, first. That's, uh... Freedom's Promise. Uh, seems like an all-around kind of stuff. 22 fire. Nine. Nine. Lost its rope. I don't know. I guess I can wear that for now. I don't think it matters, really. High Lord's Belt. Hindsight. Nope. Well, enemies drop better equipment, right? Little power. Nature damage, healing. Sure, I guess. I don't know. Get out of here. Yeah, I know the party is not full. We gotta get Aveline. I don't remember how many times I've watched that little um, loading screen. You know, back when there was no SSDs when this came out. Just gonna quick save it. Looks like it was gonna crash. Because before, like, it would take like a minute or two, one to two minutes. To the void with this. Never... Yeah, it used to take forever. So the only other bad thing is. You gotta like do a million quests in town and then you can go out and do stuff. But you don't have to, like I'll probably do is like I'll do a few quests at a time, head out, do that stuff, come back, do some others. Because what I usually did in the past was like just do everything, like talk to everybody in town. But that's a little too much, so. I'll just grab Aveline, do her quest, do it out there, and then I'll go do the I know we have to talk to the elves. To grab Meryl. I don't know if I'll use Meryl. I need a healer, so I'll just grab Anders. Um, we're gonna have to talk to everyone eventually. We'll just split it up. There she is. Aveline. Hello, Hawk. Been a while, hasn't it? What? Oh, right. Sorry. It feels like we just talked. I've been keeping an eye on you. Information is one of the few perks of this job. Watch out for Bartrand. He's a son of a bitch. I'm a Ferelden in Kirkwall. I don't have much say in who I deal with. Bust some teeth, then buy the drinks. It worked here, but guards can be strange like that. Hey, let me try that on the dwarf. Just to see his face. If you're stuck, at least bring me along. I could sleep through the jobs I'm given here. In fact, I might have a job for you. Let me know if you want to do a favor for Kirkwall. Otherwise, I'm here if you need me. Maker knows I could use more satisfying work. All right, Aveline. You have something worth doing? My patrols may be empty walks in the dark, but there's something big coming up, and I could use you. An ambush. Probably for a yeah, so as for a long, long intros, I was also thinking of Andromeda. Because that one takes forever to get started. But once you get like your um, outpost set up and 
You've got yourself it's like what two hours in like it picks up a lot like it's actually fun once you start but we can make good time running around doing stuff and no you can't run off and do it without me i trust you but i have to be there you that is the one nice thing about like mass effect one two or three is it just you just jump right into it the guard will throw you out if you kick that like you shouldn't spend so much time preparing like trying to um you know, prep the rest of the game. You know, it's a better better delivery on that. All right, so let's give you. There we go. How much longer do I have to wait? That guy literally waits there the entire game. He never gets in. So let's go under mounts the way it should be. All right, uh, auto level, auto level. I it doesn't really matter. I don't think. I don't really care. You know. Okay, so this should be level seven. I won't bother with that yet. Okay, where was Okay, so I need two points in our cane to get crushing. Oh, I see. That's cool. But we'll get it. We'll get shield. There might be some stragglers before the main group. Nothing we can't handle. Because I'm going to get smacked. I just know it. Why is it nobody ever seems happy to see us? <laughs> oh, man, I missed that. Like... Didn't they say it was supposed to be like a really short, like a peaceful route? Oh, help! Gonna get one shot. to the ambush hawk. Be ready. Nowhere near as good. Because I think you had to pay for these this armor and weapons too. But it kind of feels like cheating because it's so powerful. Ooh. <laughs> Equipped for bandits, but dead is dead and the road is clear. Captain Jevon needs to know of this. Back to the barracks for your just reward. <laughs> My just reward. Funny you say that. Stay still and try not to make any loud noises. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> I was trying to get Barrick to do it. Well, I mean, that was funny. Oh, boom. Oh, I forgot. There's freaking spiders here. Dang it. Oh, level six, eh? Hey? The mage is enveloped in a field. Yeah. Six seconds. Even better. Let's get Firestorm. That's cooler. So, in Inquisition, there's actual no healing spells at all. So you gotta, like, rely on barriers and, um... Potions, which is yeah, special. Oh, I was like pressing five. I was like, wait, why isn't Firestorm working? And then I remembered that uh, in the intro, it's set to five. Oh, yeah. Sorry, guys. If you have arachnophobia like I do. um, Yeah, the spiders are really gross in this game. So, I don't know. Maybe look away. But when I'm fighting them, I do. Old Shemlin, your kind are not welcome among the Dalish. It's a Scottish elf, I guess. I was given an amulet for someone named Marathari. How do you know that name? Wait, this is the one the Keeper spoke of. A Shemlin? I thought she'd be an elf. Enter the camp. I don't like any of them. Marathari has been waiting for you. Cause trouble. And you'll meet our blades, stranger. I don't know why they changed the elves around for the second one. It just doesn't, uh, I don't really get it. Andaranatishan, travelers. Indeed, I am Keeper Marathari. Let me look at you. There's truth in your face. A rare thing in a human. Tell me how this burden fell to you, child. A dragon fell from the sky, charged some darkspawn, then asked me to bring you this amulet. No big deal. You are blessed by luck, then. I will pray that Mithal watches over your path. The amulet must be taken to an altar at the top of the mountain and given a Dalish rite for the departed. Then, return the amulet to me. Do this and your debt will be repaid. Are you going to teach me this rite for the departed? I will send my first with you. She will see to it the ritual is done. And when it is complete, I must ask that you take her with you when you go. I live in Kirkwall. I don't have room for stray elves. You need to look after her. <laughs> Simply take her to the city. You will find Meryl waiting for you on the trail just up the mountain. Dareth Shira. <laughs> You're gonna start the elf orf orphanage. Uh, what do you got? Uh, goodbye, Sir Wesley Shield. Oh wait, I didn't equip um Dalish crafting is second to none. Everyone's stuff. Carver, and then he should have a belt that I have. Where is his? There it is. Uh, then I gave him 
Eyes of the bearded dragon, and then should be a ring. Or a belt. Okay, a belt and an amulet, I guess. Aveline. That's enough for now. Okay. Oh, what the heck? Where's your hair? Well, uh, at least she has a head. I'm so sorry. I didn't ask your name. Unless it's not rude to ask a human their name, is it? I'm Meryl, which you probably knew already. I'm rambling, sorry. My name is Hawk. Glad to make your acquaintance, Meryl. Thank you. I'm afraid I'm not very experienced with your kind. The Keeper said you came from Ferelden. I spent most of my life there. We only came north a few years ago. Have you been in the free marches long? Do you like it here? The blight forced me here. Wasn't my choice. I understand. We wouldn't have come here by choice either. We should go. Your task is for Asha Belinar. It's not wise to make her wait. Let's get this over with. Cranky Hawk. Okay. Oh, that corpse just doesn't want to die. didn't mention you were a mage. All keepers know a bit of old magic. The stories tell us that all Elven once had the gift. But like so many things, it was lost. It's a keeper's job to remember, to restore what we can. Please keep turning skeletons into toads for us. But I never... Uh... Right. Not literally. Happy to help. I've done a little fighting before, but it, it was always alone. I try not to hit anyone. On our side, I mean. I'm babbling again. Let's go. On a side note, um, I think Andromeda is like a really good looking game still. I don't know. Like, it was a good space game. Like I enjoyed it more than I enjoyed Starfield. Funny, actually, I got um, an uptake in uh, the amount of people playing it after uh, Starfield came out. Yeah, like it's good. I mean, it's has a very weak intro. Like, takes way too long to get moving. But aside from the interesting animations, uh, you know, it's I actually do like it. I got way too much hate back in the day. Like people just hate mob. You know, people just pile on for gaming and it's really weird. I don't because I don't remember people doing that, like I'm sensing a story here. I have I blame social media too. And I will save our clan whatever you think. Sundermount seems very mountainous today, doesn't it? Lots of rock and hillside. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Let's go. We should hurry. Ooh, hello. Elf fruit. Roots of elves. The combat was really good. I'll say that. Like, it feels feel really good compared to the other Mass Effects. I'm sorry. 
It just sounds so cool to like fight stuff. It feels cool to fight in that game. Like even the profiles, um, at first I didn't really like them. But being able to switch all the time is kind of nice. Is there anything I can do to help? It's kind of you to ask. I'm fine. Even if my people don't appreciate my efforts, I must see this through. Let's go. But I'm not really holding a hope for um, Mass Effect 4. I think it's probably going to get cancelled. Or else it'll just take forever to come out. You know, because Dreadwolf's been like, what, 10 years? I really wish they just had not done Anthem and then we would have already had a title. Um, but they did a really good job converting, um, like remastering the Mass Effect trilogy. Like that was a plus on them. That was probably the sales from that probably saved the company, I think. But you know. I like how look how big their butts are, like I don't like that. I hate the corrupted spiders in the deep roads though. Ugh. Seems the worst. Hmm. What is this? Loves of the spiral eye. So that's the other piece of armor I have. No, does it look more magey? Kind of. But remember these things aren't... I get like level 11 ones too. Silver light. Save her! And I hate the crunching noise when they, they overwhelm you in, in Origins. Like, oh my god. Just hear them like crushing your bones. Oh, it's the worst. Uh, oh, that's where we gotta go. But oh, what's up here, pray tell? Here we go! Zombies. Demons. Doesn't work like that. Uh, F3? Yeah. All right. A deer loading screen. Uh, a pile of bones. I can open the way forward. One moment. Oh, yes. Right. 
That was not normal. That was blood magic. Yes, it was blood magic, but I know what I'm doing. The spirit helped us, didn't it? The barrier is gone, certainly. Should you encourage her? Be careful up ahead. Restless things prowl the heights. Silence, Aveline. The elders came here to sleep. You will never know true power. Uthanara. The endless dream, they called it. But they don't sleep peacefully anymore. Oh, they did not like that, <laughs> did they? Yeah. Power. Okay. Ooh, mushrooms. I don't know. Do you guys actually read those codexes? I do not have the time to read that much. Yeah, like, uh, I don't care about lore that much. I don't have time to read all this stuff. It's like the lore books in like Skyrim too, and like, I'm like ah, I don't have time for this. Oh, whoops. Uh, why did I do that? Come on out, doggy. Of the Magister. Nice. Ooh, fire damage. Okay, what's this one? Willpower. One of the people. I see. So young and bright. Do you know who I am? Beyond that title. I know only a little. Then stand. The people bend their knee too quickly. So refreshing to see someone who keeps their end of a bargain. I half expected my amulet to end up in a merchant's pocket. You were inside that amulet the entire time? Just a piece. A small piece. But it was all I needed. A bit of security, should the inevitable occur. And if I know my Morrigan, it already has. You have plans, I take it. Destiny awaits us both. Wouldn't it be easier for her to just, like, fly across the sea? Word of advice. Now we actually don't hear from Morgan until stand upon the precipice of change. Inquisition. The world fears the inevitable plummet into the abyss. Watch for that moment. Who knows? Maybe can, she can only maintain her form for like I don't know, an hour. It is only when you fall that you learn. What should I do? Do as I do. Become a dragon. <laughs> you could never be a dragon. As for you, child, 
Step carefully. <laughs> She's like, no. no. Than when your eyes are shut. Master Anas Ashabelina. Now the time has come for me to leave. You know, it'd be really cool if for Dreadwolf they bring back Blood Mage and let you turn into a demon, like temporarily. That'd be kind of cool. Or at least like all your abilities turn into like demonic abilities or whatever. And yeah, <laughs> that'd be sweet. Metamorphosis. Now, what's over here, I wonder? I'm pretty sure this is the quest. This leads up to the, the end of uh, Morgan's uh, loyalty mission. I think. So these guys are a pain in the ass in Origins because they like, they'll like death grip you and pull you in. And they hit like really hard. Yeah, like that. <laughs> yeah. guy had a Mambari collar. What is he doing with a dog collar? Yeah, that's just uh, Meryl's loyalty mission. We'll do that later. I try to do all of them, even though I don't use all the um, companions. So I guess uh, we can head. Oh, that's a messed up texture. <laughs> Jeez. Maserana's child, your debt is paid in full. It isn't too late to change your mind, Dalen. Darath Shiral, Keeper. I'm ready. Let's depart. Yeah, Mero's lo loyalty mission is pretty sad, too. Have you ever done it? <laughs> All the trees. I don't know why they're messing up now, but that's kind of funny. It almost reminds me of like Fault 3 bucks. Elganon. Is this. Is this really where the elves live? Not the prettiest part of Kirkwall, but it doesn't have a view of the giant chains. Take what you can get. I didn't think it would be so... so... I've never seen so many people in one place before. It seems so lonely. Working your way up will be fun. All right, that was a lie. It won't be fun. Some adventurer I am. Barely set out and I'm already daunted. Thank you for everything. For all your help. Will you come visit me? Not now, of course. But maybe later. I could use a friend. I'd like that, Meryl. Thank you. Oh, I'm thanking you too much, aren't I? I mean it, though. Okay, um, Please, sir. who's this? I am sorry for your loss, mistress, but I can offer your son mercy only if he turns himself in. I'm trying to find him, but... The Templars cannot tolerate apostates. This will be mother if we're not careful. <laughs> you won't be able to protect your son from the Templars alone. I have done all I can to protect him. I am Ariane. My boy, Fenrir, he's all I have. Oh, I remember this. When I learned he had magic, I could not bear to send him to the Circle. But his connection to the Fade, it gives him nightmares. Dreams of demons speaking in his mind. 
I would rather lose him to the circle than to himself. When I find him, it's my decision whether he is safer in the circle or eliminated. No, please don't hurt him. He's just a boy. Talk to him. I know you'll see he's a good lad. He just needs to be protected from himself. I don't know where Fainrail has gone, but there are two places you might start your search. Sir Thrask has been looking for him. If you speak to him in the gallows, he'll be able to tell you what ground he's already covered. And Fainrail's father, Vincento, recently returned from Antiva. He's a merchant in the Low Town Bazaar. Fainrail might have sought him out. I will not leave you fearful for a moment longer than necessary. The boy sounds one breath away from becoming an abomination. Let's get to him, fast. Thank you. It has been a lonely time hiding. It's almost a relief to finally confront this openly. Greetings. You kept my brother out far too late when- Varric, do you do anything? Am I the next stop in your career evaluations? Joy of joys. You watch and you talk. Is that it? You are dismissing hallmarks of both the utterly- Wait, I think Varric um, wants to talk about the ex expedition, doesn't he? It means so should I go to like, the hangman or should I go to the hangman at night? You got paid to guard or unguard. That makes no sense. Good. Greetings, my lady. You look like a woman who'd appreciate the finest rubies from Antiva raising her lovely neck. I bring only the best northern merchandise to the free marches. Actually, I'm more interested in your son. My lady, I'm a bachelor. I've never met a woman of sufficient beauty and charm to tie Vincento down. <laughs> That's the best you can do with a god staring you in the face. Let us not ruin the day with such weighty thoughts. Perhaps I could show you my silks. We're not Templars, Cyril. Fainriel has nothing to fear from us. Maldilion, you are a mate. I suppose you'd be kind then to a boy who resists being taken in by Templars? Oh, sure. Like his family. The boy's in over his head. So why send him to the only man I know who doesn't despise mages? A former Templar named Samson. Why would a Templar help him? His conscience plagues him, having served the Templars too long. He now helps mages on the run. He stays out of sight during the day. At night, he stays near Dark Town. That's the best place to find him. Oh, Dark Town it is. Oh boy. My favorite place. Wait, those are like better stats. Cool, I actually look like a mage now. Um, wait, can I go, where's that bar? Oh, there it is. Yeah, aren't you supposed to like talk to Varric in here? I remember that. So, here's the thing. We need to find a way into the deep roads. Bartrand can lead us to the right place once we're down there, but we need a good entrance. How do you plan an expedition into the deep roads without knowing a way in? We need an entrance that's close to our destination, but isn't already plundered or filled with darkspawn. Fortunately, I've received some new information. There's a Grey Warden in the city. If anyone knows how to get down there, it'll be him. We may need to wring it out of him. Wardens can be secretive. Uh, let's look at our options first. I'd rather not fight a warden unless we have to. Supposedly, this Grey Warden came in with some other Ferelden refugees not long ago. A Lowtown woman named Loreen has been helping the Ferelden's. We talk to her. Maybe we learn where he is. I'll keep after my contacts, see if I can drum up any other work. 
Oh, he didn't like that. Oh, Maddie's mad at me now. I'm pissing everyone off. A Ferelden in the guard. What will they think of next? You have a problem with that. Well, let's go to nighttime. How can these nighttime streets be so dangerous? We okay, so uh, Samson, Wayward Son, there it is. To clear these idiot thugs out. Her rival. Hey, she likes me. Screw Carver. Oh, this guy looks greasy. Uh, old Vincento said someone might come sniffing around. You're looking for the boy, right? Feign something. I'll tell you now. There's not much I can do for you. Just looking at you, I'd say you're a man who helps anyone for the right price. What kind of price? Help me and you don't end up dead. The Maker don't look kindly on them who tease broken old men. Right. The lad came to me, not a silver in his pockets. Told him there's nothing I can do for him. Charity to a point, I see. I appointed him to a ship captain I know, Rayner. Sometimes he'll take on runaways. Took another apostate last week, girl I sent him. Might have gone wrong though. I heard rumors he took the both of them captive instead. If Fainrail's not in one piece when I find him, I'm coming after you next. Rainer in, friend. Was just trying to do the lad a good turn. Rumor has it, Rainer had the pair of them locked inside a Keys warehouse, somewhere close to Dockside. You want to go looking? You might find the lad before he gets ransomed to the Templars. Or worse. What a nice guy. I guess we could just exit uh, this way. So, Black Emporium, Birthrights, Wayward Sun. Never a shortage of idiots who think they can take the streets Last in the dark. Last one to strike by the break! Oh, you guys walked right into that. This way. Yeah, I figured doing like one or two quests at a time is okay. I don't want to like talk to a million people. Hello, ship captain. Bugger off. Bugger off. Yeah, I like the textures that this mod adds too, like it and the lighting. You know, what's really weird is this robe from the first and second game. I never really understood it because, like, why is it cut off there? I guess so you can move your hands more freely. But it looks like like a um, you know, clothes that's like too tight on you or too small. Oh, good job, guys. <laughs> he set up his own trap.
to go. Ooh, I missed a crate. Yeah, I don't know where we would be without mods, you know? Would people have really played Fallout 3 as much? Or Fallout 4? Skyrim? You know, I actually didn't know mods existed in Oblivion for a long time. Like, I played that game vanilla. For quite a while. Uh... I kind of want to check all this stuff over here. And there's nothing. Get a hold of her. Please help me. Anyone. Get the hands. I heard they can't do no spells without hands. Know nothing of magic. Uh oh. What did you do, you dummy? Oh, there's Rainer. Rain it in, Rainer. Corpses. You do get results, don't you? Check if there's anything to identify the girl. Her family will want to know. Ooh, demonic rod. That looks cool. Probably. Well, rip Olivia. Demonic Rod. Oh, that looks kind of lame. <laughs> Booba! Uh, Carlathon. That's right. All right, off to Darktown, I believe. Because we got to talk to Anders, break into our house, and look for this Danzig guy. Why are you guys hanging out by a stinky uh, manhole? <laughs> Oh wait, let's just take this exit. So we want Anders with us. And we want Varric with us. That means I'd have to leave Aveline to do the, the ending properly. For this game. Did you approve my application? I can't make you a guard, Carver. We were both soldiers. Why won't they take me? I was an officer, and I follow orders. No, you don't. I also think of others before myself. You seem tired of that, and that's dangerous. I can't do that. Just when it's not my not choice. Going to happen. You told them not to. Well, this looks like the place. Oh wait, I have to talk to um that Ferelden lady first. I forgot. I'm <laughs> getting ahead of myself. I guess we can do this and then we will do uh that kid after. Follow my lead. Well not do him, but like we'll do the quest for him. Getting up there, I guess. Oh, 
Ooh, Origins music. <laughs> See, the barrels are bugged out too. Textures are messed up. That's funny. I think it was a multi pack texture pack and I didn't install all of them. Yeah, same with that latch there. By all means. Lead on. Get ready. I beat it. <laughs> Get out of here. Man, everyone's leveling up right now. Get you some more HP. One more level and then true power is mined. And then I can get some new... I, I think it's level 11 is my next set of armor. Wow, that slaver got destroyed. Looks like he was saying some speech and then he just yeah got wrecked. Oh, well, it's nice up here. Rakros Diamond. So this is it. Grandfather's will. Let's just take it back to Yeah, I don't think I installed all the texture packs that I was supposed to. I don't think there's any point in delaying the news. I'll probably just do that for uh next week or whatever. Go back and download we download them, overwrite them. So I'm just saying blood's blood and all but you are taking advantage of my hospitality it's only fair if you make something of a monthly contribution you sold my children into servitude now you're asking me to pay rent uh, maybe just put something towards food we found the will grandfather left everything to mother and us I guess he had some sense after all. See for yourself. Uh, ah, I should maybe... To my daughter Leandra and all children born of her, the estate in Hightown and all associated revenues. We have a home, Mother. A real home. They forgave me. Mother forgave me. But... Gamlin, how could you? You're the one who ran away, Leandra. What happened to love is so much more important than money. It is. You didn't even come home for the funeral. The twins were a week old. We all have our burdens. Mine was looking after a life you abandoned. How long was I supposed to wait? I doubt you let the ashes get cold. I took care of father. I stayed. And on his deathbed, all he could talk about was Leandra. Look, sister, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have done it, but I did. And there's nothing I can do to get it back. I don't expect that, Gamlin. It's enough to know mother and father didn't die angry. I'll petition the Viscount for rights to reclaim the estate. 
Make a willing. You'll have your house back within weeks. You don't have the coin or standing to even get an audience with the Viscount. You've got to be someone in this city to live in that house again. Then I had better get started. Oh, <laughs> what a weasel. Okay, so what level was this armor that I was looking at? Uh... Occam's Bequest is Bequest. <laughs> Bequest. 15. 17. Oh yeah, it's, it's going to be a while. I need to sell a bunch of stuff too, I think. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's do Carver. Like that. Dark Town, Black Emporium, I Town. Oh man, I got like a million quests here. Yeah, I'm just gonna vendor whatever else I've left because I don't even care that much about the rest of the gear. Just don't, all right? You're looking for fodder. Just taking up space and yeah. You think you're that interesting? I have enough trouble being overshadowed as it is. I don't need to get caught under an imaginary me too. Okay, plastic cuffs. Sell those. Garbage. Okay, and uh, junk. There we go. Don't you worry. I'm not in the business of lullabies or children's stories. Yeah, what I'll probably do is like pick this up uh, maybe on Wednesday or something. Get these fixed and keep going. Who knows? I haven't made up my mind yet. Let's see what happens. Just <laughs> it's just funny, like so many missing textures now. If you're seeking aid, leave your name with my girl. We serve everyone here. No one came from Ferelden without trouble. But I can't give priority to anyone who's already found work and lodging. I hear you know where I can find a Ferelden Grey Warden. Only Ferelden Grey Warden I've heard of is sitting on the throne. We're out of the Blight's path now. Why would you need a warden? The healer was one of them once, wasn't he? A warden? Well, he's not now, and busy enough without answering fool questions about it. Who are you protecting? You see what our people face in Kirkwall. They have no jobs, no homes. Most can barely buy bread. This healer... He serves them without thought for coin. He's closed their wounds, delivered their children. And yet he needs to hide. He's a good man. I won't lose him to the blighted Templars. Your healer is in no danger from me. Right. Perfectly safe if he cooperates. I suppose it isn't my secret to keep. Anders has certainly been free enough with his services. Refugees in Darktown know to find the healer Look for the lit lantern. If you have need enough, Anders will be within. Please, my mother, don't let her lose another baby. Yeah, that's kind of weird when I'm starting the stream up with uh, EA. Because they've never asked me to do that, like verify my identity. I wonder if like the last time I was doing that... About the healer. I had my VP on on maybe. To mages in this town. You want him safe? Don't pick fights with other Ferelden's while the Templars are after us all. Ferelden? But you, your clothes. I figured you for a Kirkwaller. Sorry. Make her bless the rule of our King Alistair. Yeah, I keep on walking. 
So there's nothing left here. Let's go to the docks, maybe. Gallows, that's right. Talk to my... We have found neither hide nor hair of the lad, Fainreal. I can only think he has fallen victim to demons or slavers. I found this. It was addressed to you. It seems to be from your daughter. My daughter? Then... You know what she is. How she died. When I traced her to that warehouse, I should have forced her into the circle. My own weakness in the face of her pleas is what destroyed her. It is why I urged Ariani not to give in when Fainreal wished to hide. If only I had been so strong for Olivia. You have my sympathies. Do not fear the Templars finding out. Thank you. She is at peace now. I would not wish to see her. Wait, I thought Templars were supposed to be celibate. Mages. You talk. I'm going to ask the guards about their training. I know your face. I am Tobrias. You and that man are both orcs. I remember your father. Malcolm was a good man. My father must have left quite an impression. The letter I found was ancient. I needn't tell his own child how special he was. As to the letter, it pained me to send news of the Templar's death. The Templar? He allowed your father to leave Kirkwall. Rule is not served by caging the best of us. A wise man. Not what I would expect from a Templar. There was a time when the rules of the Order could be interpreted to suit a situation. Unlike these days, I will send the letters I held. It seems fitting that they return to family. Okay, bye bye. Such a friendship. Few like your father remain. Even fewer like the Templar. Rest well at the Maker's side, Sir Morivar Carver. <laughs> Keep forgetting about the textures. Um, that's weapons. Armor. Oh, is that it for this? Yeah. been happy never to come back here oh, i don't talk to him actually wait what is i don't remember what this is for ah welcome my dear my apologies actually if you're interested i could use a bit of help to remedy that how can i help it's been too dangerous to leave the city of late uh, perhaps you could find them you'll be compensated for your time have no fear i'll also give you first pick of my make up a list of what you need yeah, okay. The All first right. Has up these uh, done here. I think we just have Dark Tower. Yeah, spending too much time in town. I just want to get done. Yeah. Wayward Sun, Tranquility, but isn't Tranquility at night? Yeah, that's what I thought. Maybe I should put you to use, Farrick. Have you penned some warnings for the lawless? 
There's a dead guy behind me. Rip. They had meat in High Town. I smelled it once. Oh, there's Danzig. Why, look here, boys. Volunteers. Clap them in irons and let's see what the Tavinters will pay for them. The boy you bought from Captain Rayner. Where is he? Feisty don't get you a better price. Shut this bitch up. Well, that was rude. Man, just they guide you. Well, okay then. Wounded ghost, hey? All right. I don't think I can do that. Not likely. Eric, you suck. Okay. Sister plus remains. He was rude. Jeez. Call me the B word without even knowing my name. Freedom. What a crock. All right, let's uh, we'll talk to Anders with some more missing textures. Yeehaw. a sanctum of healing and salvation. Why do you threaten it? I want to know about the Deep Roads. Did the Warden send you to bring me back? I'm not going. Those bastards made me get rid of my cat. Poor Sir Pounce a lot. He hated the Deep Roads. I'm part of an expedition to the Deep Roads. And I'll pay to find an entrance. Hmm. If I wanted money, I've been going about it all wrong. You can't imagine what I've come through to get here. I'm not interested. Although, a favor for a favor. Does that sound like a fair deal? You help me, I'll help you. We'll get to the deep roads ourselves. Wait. I have a warden map of the depths in this area. But there's a price. I came to Kirkwall to aid a friend, a mage, a prisoner in the wretched gallows. The Templars learned of my plans to free him. Help me bring him safely past them, and you shall have your maps. I would help any mage in such circumstances. Map or no. Better make this good. We're risking a lot if we anger the Templars. I welcome your aid. I have already sent word for Carl to meet me in the Chantry tonight. Join us there, and we'll ensure that no matter who is with him, we all walk away free. Carver is like so worried about the Templars, like... Carver, come on. I think uh, maybe we'll try and do something outside, because I'm kind of sick of talking to people right now. Maybe <laughs> I can go to the coast.
What do we got? Uh, two quests. Well, one. Herbalist task can be done. Uh, I mean, that's the nice thing about Origins, too. Like, there's a little bit of talking, but then they send you out to do a bunch of stuff. I find that, like, there's a certain point in this game where there's a little too much stuff in town. Like, all at once. And it sort of feels like an MMO, kind of like it's like a hub. You pick up a whole bunch of stuff, then you go out and do it, then come back, and then, you know, do it all over again. Here we go. Oh. There. Prison time. The danger is past. Are you alright? No thanks to this lot. Can't get a decent blade at a bargain anymore. You though. You're what a man needs. A skilled enthusiast. You can start making sense any time now. My manners. Javaris Tintop, merchant and investor. I need forward thinkers to help court the Kunari. Court the Kunari? Make her think of the children. Those hornheads in Kirkwall have a powder that explodes. And it's just dust. No lyrium, no demons. Anyone can use it. I often look at every second idiot and think, he needs more power. I doubt they were eager to sell. That Arishok said I wasn't worthy. That only their outcast, the Talvashoth, or that mercenary. I said, great, I'll go talk to them. Didn't go over well. But, made me think. Maybe he'll bargain if I get rid of something that bothers him more than, well, me. The Talvashoth. The Talvashoth. Are you up for some paid hunting? I suppose there could be a reward for these Talvashoth. As long as you do it, I'm happy. Now, best I could figure, they're up the wounded coast, a whole camp. Take their heads off and meet me at the compound in Kirkwall. Get this right, and we'll be richly rewarded. Richly. Okay, then. Um. I thought I had a quest here. Thoughts. Oh, maybe it's nighttime. Oh no. Uh, should we go? Hmm. Interesting. All right, uh, I guess uh, <laughs> we'll just do something else. I'll go to Sutter Mount and then I'll go to that place again and maybe the map will change. Gone. Curious. There we go. So, Carver. Have you thought about what you'll do if your expedition doesn't pay off? This is our only chance, and you know it. You're so damned proud you couldn't pick up a trade. And who would take a Ferelden apprentice? Maybe in another year I could work my way up to Piss Boy. Fine, let's crawl down some holes. Good bloody luck for your sake. Uh, give me a sec. I'm gonna tab out for a second.
I was thinking, um, how long it would take to fix those textures. I think I'll just do this real quick because I think what I did was I didn't do the all in one. I just did the pack one. And then for this, I uh, didn't do the environmental. So what I'm going to do is just drop these three. Okay, so that's going to take about two minutes. I'll check back in five minutes and should be done. Oh, uh, let's give him some cunning. So he can actually open stuff. I'll, uh, I'll update. I think they're fixed. I think. Cause I'm pretty sure all the boxes and barrels were messed up before. Take one more step and the boy dies. Put the sword down. I just want to talk. You want the boy? Match the offer I have from Tavinta. Undamaged mage flesh, full market price. Give me the boy and all your gold, and I'll let you live. You overreach, Southerner. Get back, boy. Witness your hero's fate. Get wrecked. Guy has like a lot of health, doesn't he? You would have let him kill me. He had a sword at my throat, and you just I mean, thank you, but what if you were wrong? Ooh. Whoa, Jesus. Where did that sneeze come from? Um, this guy's an annoying, this little brat. You were too valuable for him to kill. Is that my choice? Prisoner or slave? Yep. Who are you? Are you working for the Templars? Your mother sent me. Huh. Hardly a difference. I can't believe her. My whole life it was all, I'll love you and protect you. Then I have some bad dreams and it's off to the Templars. You belong in the circle of Magi. Well, I'm not going. I was trying to get to the Dalish. They won't be afraid of my magic. You'd be alone among the Dalish. Even more than a Dalish would be here. Compared to being held prisoner or made tranquil. I'll risk being lonely. Look. I know it's different in other kingdoms, but here, no one helps circle mages. Anything the Templars don't like, you get the brand. The Dalish. They've had magic forever. They could teach me. I won't be a danger, I swear. His own mother says he's played by demons. Do you really want him loose? Do we really? I'm sorry, Fainreal. You'll learn to control your abilities at the Circle. I saw what you did to those Tavintas. I cannot hope to fight you. Fine. Go and get your blood money. Tell my mother she won. But she'll be the only one I don't miss when they lock me away. Whatever their difference is, his mother deserves to know he's alive. Oh, what a brat. Uh... 
That's what I was. I want to turn off the gore. Eric! Oh no! Right, he died. <laughs> Here you go. Okay. Rip. Hey, guys, come on. Let me out. Anything else here? Okay, so that's where we came from. There's nothing up here. Yeah. Hello. Nice. Level 20. Okie dokie, artichokey. Let's go north. Still think you're and deal with the Talvashoth. Your brother. Still riding side set while bitching at your betters? Drinks later. Never miss him. As soon as I get Anders, Carver is getting the boots. Well, either Anders or um, Isabella. Further, human. Calvishoth control these passages. I am more than capable of meeting any threat. So I see. I expected to warn a caravan, not a well-equipped tracker. The path ahead is littered with my kind. If you are as skilled as you look, it would please me if you killed them. You have turned your back on your kin. Yes, for a second time. I did not like my... Roll. So I left the queue. I do not wish to be a murdering thief. So I left these Talvishoth to warn their victims. You are no victim. So now I will leave. If they have offended you so much, help me go after them. But I am worse. They don't want to raise their swords for coin. So they murder and steal. They cling to the honor they held under the cube. My sword means nothing. I will sell it and myself as mercenary. Kunare would say I am worse. If your blade is on the market, I'll pay. No. Are you sure you know what mercenary means? Taking payment to face Talvishov only proves that I've sold the last of myself. I know what I am. I don't need to belabor it. You have my word of caution, human. Heed it or do not. The more no. they talk, the less I understand. Cast system. All right. Oh, please don't crash. Thank you. And this is the only Dragon Age where you don't actually don't have to unlock your specialization. You can just have it, I guess, when you level up.
Come back. Not like all you useless person. Can't open anything. I think they're mad I took their chest. Seems to be unhealthy. Well, now that I've just wiped out like a Kunari settlement. These guys live in here. Not very comfy paced place to live. I remember that spell I was thinking about. It was um, Curse of Weakness or whatever it was. It's, you know, the target takes massive damage over time and they can't heal at all. Yeah, that was super overpowered. I remember that now from Origins. Oh, that's nice. Traps. I'm pretty sure that Talvashoth has been shooting at us for like a minute. More silver light. And now we go south. Just sworn we were just here.
Ooh, I just got killed there. That would have been not very good. Red Grace, what's this? Oh, it's a great sword. Carver, it's all yours. And you can't wear it. No sword for you. Fire damage, eh? The helmet, though. You're a wizard. Okay. So much junk to sell. It's not even funny. All right, we're done with the Wounded Coast. Tranquility. I don't make my guards fight gangs in dark corners, but if you'd like to help. Dark corners, eh? Hooligans. Did you um? Did you just like the stream glitch out on your phone? I'm kind of wondering if it's just too much bitrate because I set my bitrate so high. Oh, you know I can bump it down to like I don't know ten thousand. See if that helps. It's at eighteen right now. I've heard a few people say that. No Templars so far. Are you ready? I didn't see anyone suspicious out here. Let's do this fast. All right. I'll handle the talking. You watch for Templars. Give me a sec. Just let me talk. We'll just bump it down a bit if I can. Right, let's try 10,000. If that helps. Uh, so check in um, 10 seconds. Or 30 seconds. It should update. Let me know if the quality is worse. If it does, I'll bump it up a few thousand. Oh, Carl's right there. Wait, can I go in that room? No. Anders, I know you too well. 
I knew you would never give up. What's wrong? Why are you talking like... I was too rebellious, like you. The Templars knew I had to be... made an example of. No! How else will mages ever master themselves? You'll understand, Anders. As soon as the Templars teach you to control yourself. This is the apostate. No! You will never take another mage as you took him! All right, we're killing Templars. Wait, aren't some um, Templars supposed to be resistant to magic? I was just thinking about that. Or is that like just in lore? Probably. I... Anders, what did you do? It's like... You brought a piece of the Fade into this world. I had already forgotten what that feels like. I thought the Tranquil were cut off from the Fade forever. When you're Tranquil, you never think on your life before. But it's like the Fade itself is inside, Anders, burning like a sun. Please, kill me before I forget again. I don't know how you brought it back, but it's fading. Carl, no. I would rather die than be tranquil. Help him. I got here too late. I'm sorry, Carl. I'm so sorry. Now! It's fading! Why do you look at me like that? Goodbye. <laughs> we should leave before more Templars come. Let's murder some Tranquil on our way out. Well, maybe I should get my map though. That wasn't normal magic you just did, was it? I... This is hard to explain. When I was in Amaranthi, I met a spirit of justice who was trapped outside the Fade. We became friends, and he recognized the injustice that mages and Thaders face every day. Just say whatever you have to say. To live outside the Fade, he needed a host. I offered to help him. We were going to I don't think that the, the um, bitrate will change until the next stream. So um, on Monday, just let me know how it is. I guess I had too much anger. Once he was um, but I bumped it down to ten thousand. Changed. This is obviously difficult for you. I think it's because like if it's too much bitrate, like for your internet, if you have bad internet, it won't keep up. I thought I was helping. I'm thinking that's ha what's happening for you. He would have died, I guess. If that even means anything. I actually don't even know what most people use. He knew what mages have suffered. But I just I chose 18k cuz I was like that that's the cap. Things that have always outraged me, but I could never do anything about. He comes out. And he is no longer my friend Justice. He is a force of vengeance and he has no grasp of mercy. Is there anything I can do for you? You're the first one I've ever told this. Thank you for not running away. My maps are yours. As am I, if you wish me to join your expedition. I thought I was done with the Grey Wardens. But if you have any need of me, I will be waiting here. Bye, Carver. Okay.
All right. So, let us. What? Just one. Uh, Dark Town. So the way it should be, and a bit in rescue. Old Town's where it's sun. Okay. Insist if you must, but Viscount Dumas will see no one. If you've news of Seamus, I will relay it to him. Fine. Tell Dumas my scouts have tracked the boy and his canary captor to the wounded coast. I'm taking a full company after them, and when I return, I expect him to make a show of the reward. So many to deal with one Kunari seems excessive. He may be Talbashoth. The winters leave nothing to chance. Get out of my bloody way! Yes, what is it? Looks like I'm not the only one who saw the bounty posting. Apparently so. And I am regretting it. As I told the others, Viscount Dumas' son, Seamus, is missing. We suspect he was taken by a Kunari. If you would like to try your hand at securing his safe return, feel free. I have certainly granted no exclusivity to the Winters and their violent approach. The boy will be home soon enough. Declare it if you like. But the reward goes to whomever brings him back safe. A discussion you are welcome to have with the Winters, should you encounter them on the Wounded Coast. Messer, please stop. I have a feeling we're going to have to fight them. I do hope the Viscount remembers to have some bloody peasant. The Viscount must be terribly busy. Not much room in the barracks, but there's nowhere. There's Jevon's office. Wait while I explain our initiative. I don't know how they do it where you're from, guardswoman, but I decide the patrols, not you and your whims. You may have been put up for lieutenant in your first year, but I'll have no show-offs in my command. Have I made myself clear? Report to your post before I have you and your Ferelden accomplice jailed. A lot of yelling for doing him a favor. We killed a band of highwaymen. What does it matter whose patrol it was? It's not the first time he's made me wonder like this. Something is very wrong. So, let's find out whose toes you actually stepped on. Then we should check the duty roster, and see who was supposed to take that route. What have I stepped in this time? Threaten my friends. Not letting that one go, Captain. Aveline! I owe you for clearing the ambush the other night. Saved me a mess of trouble. Brennan, that route was yours? It was. Single patrol. I'd have been dead for sure. So there was nothing unusual about it at all? It had been clear for weeks. It didn't get unusual until after we heard about you and Aveline. The captain reassigned me after he heard what you did, and I passed the satchel to Donick for his patrol tonight. The satchel? Pay and order assignment. Captain has us run deliveries to the outposts during light duty. It's usually just an updated copy of the roster. The satchel for that night was heavy, though. Anyway, thanks again, Aveline. You're a good one. So the satchel gets heavy the same day we discover an ambush? Hmm. Curious. A messy way to pass information. And Brennan already sent it along. Another guard is walking into the same trap. I can't let that happen. Brennan said Donick. A good man. Donick, Donick. I've got his route. A night walk in Lowtown. Let's go make sure his quiet patrol stays that way. 
the guard who'll throw you out if you kick that wall one more time. The Viscount must be terribly busy. I've been waiting most of the day. He ain't that busy. All right, so we're going to talk to the Canary, I guess, right? Why is every circle? I got her promise. Yep. This dwarf a merchant or a smith? I got a you left out. Let me pass. I have business with the dwarf Javaris and your Arashok. The short mouth, yes. Enter if you must, Basra. Ah, my right hand arrives. Summon your Arashok. The bargain is done. About time you showed. I've been here for hours. <clears throat> Illustrious Aeroshock, I am here to report that your hated Talvashoth were felled, one and all. Right? Uh, yes, yes, yes they were. So, I'm ready to open negotiations for the explosive powder, as we agreed. No. He's not getting it. Say something. The Tal Vashoth camped at the Wounded Coast are dead. You won't honor your bargain? There is no bargain to honor. His offer for the Gatlock was refused, so he invented a task to prove his worth, when he has none. I broke my beard getting your outcasts killed. You hired someone more competent, and I'll stand in their shadow pretending it is yours. You demean her accomplishment. Get out of my sight before I bother lifting my sword. Nevertheless, you have benefited from his action. Do you think we are unable to hunt our own outcasts? This was interference, nothing more. So I get nothing for all this work? If anything, we have been denied the righteous application of the wisdom of the Kune. What payment should I exact for that? Go, dwarf, before I begin my tally. You may want to take this opportunity to go. But... He has to sell. It's a product. People want it. There is no profit in empowering those not of the Kune. The means of creating the Gatlock is ours alone. It shall be dispensed only to our enemies, in the traditional manner. You are a frustrating people. And you're fired, sobbing bunch of oxmen and dog lords. A whole lot breathing smoke. Pah. You will leave as well, human. There's no more coin for you here. Rip. <laughs> no money for me. next uh wait um wayward son that was well let's go home and then do wayward son and then we'll head up to high town and then got some stuff to do outside i guess i know um chapter two isn't quite like this like it's a little more streamlined but i find chapter one is a lot of like Run to the section of town, then run to that section of town, then run to the other one. Thinking of life in High Town. We're still a long way from cowing Templars with our titles, sister. We took a big step with this. You should respect that. Right. 
Right, the glorious Amels. A noble lineage dating to the Third Blight. You know what that means. 700 years of people sitting around saying, Wow, look how great we used to be. Mother didn't even want that life back until we got dumped here. And you only care because we're under Templar scrutiny. The Second Child Act is getting pretty stale, brother. Try it from this side. Always running after you, or taking care of Mother while you mark your territory. That's enough, Carver. Even back home, what could I be? The lone blade in a house of mages. If I excelled, it brought too much attention. That was a waste, eh? Could have found my fortune if Bethany was going to die on your watch anyway. You will not use her against me like that. She deserves better. Then you should have given better. I gave everything! Question me, mother, yourself, but not that. That's it, Carver. You're out of the party. Sister. I feel... I don't know. It's like Mother taking everything out on us. She was just scared. I don't have a place in the life she is trying to bring back. I'm here if you need me. But I must find my own way. Was you, you, and you. All right, high town. Then I want to do some stuff outside. Yeah, it's only a bad thing is like just the amount of running around and talking to people in chapter one. But I do remember. Yeah, it gets a lot better. Who's this? Elf and a dwarf I walk think I found something of yours. The House Telwain. You're lucky you're so again. short. That. Uh, like mad. You could have just stopped me, Blondie. Why waste a perfectly good setup? Godsman Eveline. I think you let this get away. You just stumbled on this. Yeah, like it almost feels like an MMO, right? Like you pick up a massive amount of quests and then you go out into an area. Good day to you. Wait, what's in here? So, you married a Templar, huh? What of it? I didn't see them. Are they all as dirty as they seem? What? Did he ever ask you to play the naughty mage and the hapless recruit? Maybe the secret desire demon and the upstanding knight? That's disgusting. I hear it's quite popular. Did you mistake? Oh yeah, you know what time it is? It is Blood Mage time. While this mode is active, Mage can use Blood Magic, sacrificing health. Okay, so you use it um, when you're getting low on mana and when you want to use an ability.
so. What do you do, Aveline? You know I'm a guard. Why are you asking? I mean in your off do The hours. For fun. You've heard of it, I hope. These are my off-duty hours. And the trend of you scaring the piss out of me continues. Please, can you help me? My brother. What happened to your brother? Karen was always so devout. So idealistic. He was so proud when the Templars accepted him. I pleaded with him not to join the Order, but he wouldn't listen. You hear dark rumors about the Templars and Knight Commander Meredith. And now my brother is gone. I'm here to help you. Just tell me what you know. Karen would write me every day. Then suddenly, no more letters. I wrote him many times with no response. I tried to see him, but Knight Commander Meredith threw me out. They won't tell me anything. Your brother may indeed be in trouble. What can I do for you? Perchance. In your journeys, if you find yourself in the gallows, ask the other recruits, Wilmard and Hugh, about my brother. They were Karen's closest friends in the Order. If anyone knows where he is, it's them. Make her bless you and watch after you in this endeavor. You know, I kind of remember this quest, too. Bringing back memories. You were there for I wish to speak with you. I've heard you have dealings with certain elements in the city. You can get things done on the sly, as they say. What of it, old man? I am a magistrate in this city, and <laughs> I expect to be addressed with respect. Especially from someone who might be working for me soon. A man I sentenced to a life in prison has escaped custody. He's been tracked to an abandoned ruin outside the city. A request that should have been made of the guard. We're both intelligent people. There's something in the ruins, isn't there? There is something, yes. There are creatures in the ruins. The guards I sent are ill-equipped to deal with such beasts. Sure. I'll take the job. Bring the fugitive in alive, quickly and quietly. Not only will you be well paid, you'll have the gratitude of a city magistrate. Useful for a refugee, wouldn't you agree? All right, let's talk to this guy. Wait, how much gold do I- oh, I, I almost got 50. Have you seen my wife, Lynette? What do you mean you can't help me? This is a domestic matter, Sirrah. If your wife has chosen to leave you, there's nothing we can do. Lynette is my wife. She's legally bound to me. Bring her back. We're done here. Useless. Why are we still paying those sluggards? Your wife is missing. I can try to find her if you like. Yes. Oh, I have been waiting for someone to say that. That foolish woman has caused me nothing but embarrassment. She needs to be dragged home. The guards disagree. They are more disagreeable than my wife. Maybe your friend is more sensible. Her family is getting suspicious. They think I might have done something to her, even if... Well, I just want to make sure they know I didn't do it. I'll try my best to find Ninette and bring her home. You should talk to Jethan at the Blooming Rose. I didn't know she visited whores until Jethan sent a letter to our house. He even sent her flowers once. Lilies, hmm? her favorite. Ah, talking about it makes my head hurt. Good luck to you, Sarah. All right. It's like a, on like a wild trail. We're from this place to that place. Talk to this person. Talk to that person. Wait. 
I think that's your house. Uh, the front entrance. Be careful if you're going into the road. Interesting place. Let's not stay here for long. If someone here tries to hire me again, I'm leaving. Madam Luke. I hear good things about you, Anders. Not what I expected. From a maid, you mean? I didn't say that. How else would you judge me? What else am I a shining example of? I don't know. Other Ferelden's lurking in Darktown? Mage or not? You have a fair point. Hey, what's Gallon doing here? I won't mention this to your mother if you can. Whatever I want. Today's my rest day, but I'll make an exception for you. What can I say? Why work if you're not working hard? Jathan, have you seen Nanette lately? Nanette? Not for several weeks, which is a shame. I enjoy her company. I hear she finally left her worthless husband. Good for her. I just wish she'd said goodbye. Do you have any idea where she might be? Well, uh... There was someone else looking for Nanette. A Templar. I believe his name was Emmerich. He wouldn't sleep with me either. I can't see why a Templar would be interested in anyone who isn't a mage. Perhaps Emmerich knows something we don't. Emmerich said he'd continue his investigation in Darktown. You could see if he's still there. And if you find Nanette, tell her to drop by and see me sometime. Dark town it is, I guess. Dark town, right? Black Emporium. Wait, I'm here or oh I'm in High Town. Low Town, Dark Town. I might actually go to the bar. I'm I try to remember when you can find Isabel. Isabella rather. Ever miss Ferelden? Of course. It was home. I would never have left willingly. But I'm not going to be my father and spend my life trying to live a memory. I didn't think I'd give it a second thought once I was gone. I mean, what did Ferelden ever do for me? But I do. I think about it. There's something here that just doesn't feel right. You mean how mages are treated? No. Your son has gone to master his talents at the Circle. He may never forgive me for sending him there, but I'd rather him alive and furious than dead and buried. As I said, I have little money, but this is a Dalish ring that has been in my family for generations. Please accept it with my thanks. Woohoo! Anders didn't like that. Not very happy.
funny, I turn into quest and then I see more quests pop up to go to a different spot. I'm kind of curious why they decided to go like this for this game, but yeah. Do you know a recruit named Karen? His sister is looking for him. We cannot speak to you, Miss Sarah. To the void with that. Karen and the others are missing. But our orders. The knights aren't doing anything to find them. Maybe it's time to ask for outside help. You can trust me. I'm only trying to keep Karen safe. I hear that Knight Commander Meredith has some new initiation you have to go through. If you're not strong enough or fervent enough in belief, you don't make it out alive. Figures. And you honestly believe that? Recruits keep going missing. Wilmot came back. What? He did. I saw him this morning. If Wilmot came back, he might know more about the other missing recruits. I bet he would. Wilmot told me he was going outside Kirkwall. Clear his head, he said. Why didn't you tell us this? Knight Captain Cullen ordered it, right before he chased after Wilmot. That wasn't too long ago. If you hurry, you may catch them on the road. It is the duty of every mage to trick. Okay. Why wouldn't she chase after? Yeah, like, why is she sitting here talking about it? Colin from Origins. I think he's the only Templar that's been in all three games, to, to come to think of it. I could use your consult, Anders. Bring it to Dark Town and I'll give you a sound. What? No. I need to know. Why? I'm a god. The first person who has to deal with me. Trouble. You want help killing people like me? Not every mage can be trusted. Nor every guard. Ooh, what's this? <laughs> Did you fall asleep? Just the person I was looking for. I need to I'm probably gonna go live Monday at like five my time, so that'll be six your time. Yeah, it's pretty late. It's like eleven twenty here. So it's probably it's way after midnight for you. However, the investigation has been a waste of time. Did you learn nothing? Most people just say she left her husband. This all started when Maren one of our circle mages disappeared. I found it odd. She was a bit older and hardly adventurous. Then I heard about Ninette and two other missing women. <laughs> I had a friend who disappeared once. Turns out he was under my bed, drunk. What? I think the disappearances are connected, and I suspect foul play is involved. Can I assist your investigation? It's no longer my investigation, Sirrah. You may take over if you wish. This battle showed that I'm no longer the warrior I used to be. I know when to walk away. Here, take my findings. Perhaps you can make more use of them. I'm going back to the gallows. I'm too old for this. A foundry in Lota. I should look into that. I go up there. Gonna find those like skellies everywhere. People just like dying all the time here.
Yeah, unfortunately, like the first part of Dragon Age 2 is not very exciting. Um, I find it picks up a lot once you start like the deep roads. Like I would say like act two and three are the best, obviously. I mean, cause like the part one is just like fetch quests to get you enough gold so you can actually get into the deep roads. Don't like that. Can't waste time, Hawk. Guardsman Donick is here somewhere. I have found a sister. Oh, Sister Patrice. Here, yeah, miss. Word is you're looking for help. And paying well. I need someone native to the dark places beneath Lowtown. If you claim as much, yes, I will pay. I am, I am. Let's just step into this alley and me and my fellows can have a look at the money on offer. Another sad low town tale in the making. As if we needed another. It does appear she could use some help, especially now. Well, thank you for your timely intervention. I am out of my element. A foolish risk in Lowtown. I had to come here to get the type of person I need. Someone of bloody skill, but also integrity. Perhaps the kind who might leap to someone's defense. I have a charge who needs passage from the city. If you are willing and capable, meet me at my safe house nearby. You make a lot of assumptions. It almost got you killed already. All the more reason to end this quickly. You must need coin. Everyone here does. Varnell! Not so helpless, I see. I hope you will come. This matter only grows more urgent with time. Oh, why wouldn't he help her then? Okay, well. So this is... Oh, this is the Nanette thing, I think. Oh, there's a weirdo up there. Demons. Jeez, how many shades did this guy summon? Something is going on here. Let's finish Sack of bones. Ooh, I don't think that she's of this world. That ring looks all leisure. Severed hand, a ring, and a pile of bones. Emmerich will want to see this. And I should bring the ring to Gislaine. It might belong to Nanette.
fell for the trap again. And Derek, Bar Derek, Derek, you suck. Get that, yeah. Okay, now can you open it? There we go. Getting close to the ambush. I'm not losing another guard to this mess. <laughs> Dotic's face is all messed up. That's funny. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> His textures are all but broken. Oh, that's funny. It's probably like one of my um texture, like it's like an NPC replacer, maybe. Tell you what, since the information you gave me was worth nothing, that's what I'll pay you. Me and my boys will get our money's worth, bitch. Oh, you poor sweet thing. Tell me, Lucky, is this worth dying for? <laughs> I didn't think so. Down the hatch. You're new around here, aren't you? Welcome. And keep your wits about you. You're nothing but tits and arse to the men in this place, and they won't hesitate to grab at both. Thanks for the advice. Anytime. I'm Isabella. Previously Captain Isabella. Sadly, without my ship, the title rings a bit hollow. You're Ferelden, aren't you? You have that look about you. I was in Denerim not too long ago. You know, you might be just what I'm looking for to solve a little problem I have. I'm always ready to help. Someone from my past has been pestering me. I've arranged for a duel. If I win, he leaves me alone. But I don't trust him to play fair. I need someone to watch my back. She was the duelist trainer in Origins. I think I could manage watching your back. <laughs> I'll bet. I've arranged to meet Hader in Hightown after dark. I'll meet you there. Is 
so. I've been dying to know. What was going through your head when you fought that ogre? For the first few seconds, what do they feed those things? <laughs> I don't know anyone else that's even seen one. You're lucky just to be standing here. Somehow, Hawk, I imagine things won't be dull with you around. Not that I expect the deep roads to be boring, mind you. Constant threat of doom does tend to keep you awake. A lot of things can keep you awake, you know. I wouldn't reach for the doom first. Sure, I could have a cup of tea in the morning. But I hear it's bad for you. I've spent my whole life in Kirkwall. Dangerous enough most days, but it doesn't compare to the deep roads. So, this will be... Let's just call it an adventure, I guess. Great. Now we're adventurous. Wait. What was that? Hold on. What do you mean daily limit? Did you see that message? What? Hey, I own the standard edition. Why did it give me that warning? Ah, uh, that was weird. Right? What the heck? <laughs> Why would there be a daily play limit on a single player game that you own? That's ridiculous. Oh, I didn't even save it today. Wow, I feel like a dummy. I'll unlock Isabella, I guess, and then we'll probably head out. I wonder if the EA app is just messed up. You know, like bugged out. to finish me off. Coward. He'll not get away with this. Come on. That was so weird, that app thing. I wonder if it's just gonna like boot me out. I've never seen that before, ever. 
But I've also never played an EA app game uh, since the app came out for more than like two hours. Isabella, should have known you'd find me here. Tell your men to burn the letters next time. Castillon was heartbroken when he heard about the shipwreck. You should have let him know you survived. It must have slipped my mind. <laughs> Where's the relic? I lost it. Castillon's just going to have to do without. Lost it? Just like you lost a ship full of valuable cargo. They weren't cargo, Hader. They were people. Those slaves were worth a hundred sovereigns a head. And you let them scurry off into the wilds. And now the relic's gone, too. Castillon won't be happy to hear that. I promise you. Your threats end here. <laughs> Rip. So much for her. Castillon won't hear about me from Hader, but he'll find me eventually. I just have to get him the relic. Simple as that. If getting the relic gets Castillon off your back, then I'll help you retrieve it. I still don't know where it is, but you'll be the first to know if I hear anything. Anyway, thanks for helping me out with Hader. I think I'll tag along for a while. There might be something I could do for you. And I have a room at the Hanged Man if you're looking for company later. Ooh. Ooh la la. Okay. The Bodhi Stripper. Alright guys. I'm probably going to stop for today. Um, I still have some stuff I need to get to do tonight. And we're at what? Three hours, three, five minutes? Yeah. So I'm probably going to be live on Monday night, but I'm going to go live earlier at my, my five by time. So I guess it'll be six uh, West Coast time or no. Five my time or something. Like, I don't know. Whatever. Uh, it's late afternoon. I'll be on. I uh, get to play um, Resident Evil 6. Finish that off. And I haven't made my made up my mind yet what I want to do later in the week, but we'll get to, we'll cross that when we get to it. Any suggestions? Let me know. Uh, I'm probably thinking one more RE stream this week, and I might even fit in a Bethesda game. Yeah, we'll see. But uh, hope you guys have a good night. Take care of yourself. Have a good weekend, and I'll see you in the next week.